Alright guys, this is Mithril back with another Borderlands 3 item guide video, and today I'm here on Eden 6 at the Voracious Canopy, and so I spawned in right here, and what we need to do is make our way here, go to the crown jewel of the Jacobs family, da -da -da, make your way through, and then what we have to do is fight Genevieve. So I will cut and come back to when we are closer to that fight. All right, so I am right here on the map. I know it's kind of hard because there's multi levels, but I am right here where the nearest save station is. That way you just jump down here and it's a quick little run to the boss fight. So the first thing I'm going to do really quickly is put back on my pearl. There she is. Is my Chaosin? All right, and did you drop it? Nope, that is not what we are looking for. So I will cut and come back to when she does drop it. All right, and we got the weapon to drop. Anybody else? I see red dot must be below me. Okay, so yeah, we got the weapons drop. That being the Polybius, I believe is how you pronounce it. It took me only three runs. So let me get rid of the counter. All right, so it's a TDR and I'm not really a fan of TDR weapons. It's got a cool skin though. It's like lava or something. Magma. All right, it's red text is 21, 11, 33, 14, 24, and then 42. Not sure what this is a reference to or what, but what it does mean is this weapon will always be elemental. We got ours in corrosive. It has a fixed magazine of eight. It fires in a four by four grid pattern. Beginning with four sets of four descending projectiles in a horizontal line, followed by four sets of projectiles in a vertical line. What? Oh, I see. Okay. All right, that may be pretty good. But for now, let us go and check this weapon out on some bad guys. All right, so I'm here at Carnivora. Let me take off Infernal Wish. Let me, oh, I have Blastmaster on. No wonder why I wasn't doing as much damage. That, and then let me put on this. That way we can see how the weapon does. Hmm. Hold on, hold on. Eh, actually. I'm not really sure I like this weapon, because it doesn't seem to be doing the greatest amount of damage. Get her, boys. Great fall. It's so beautiful. <laughs> hmm, yeah. Doesn't really seem to be the greatest weapon, so let me put on Infernal Wish. Uh, what would be best for this? Probably a Minesweeper. This one would be best if I was chucking it, but I'm not, so I'm going to put on this one. And then... Is there a TDR? Okay, there is. Mag size damage and accuracy. Okay, I guess we only got the one area of effect, and then melt chance. 
so you're probably gonna miss with this weapon more than likely so having like the, the pearl on is probably not going to be the best unless you're fighting like a big boss kind of expecting better. <laughs> this weapon might be better as a chucker than anything. Let me switch on this blast master. Or this Minesweeper, I mean, not Blastmaster. And let's just try chucking it. No, even that's really not the greatest damage either. Yeah, it looks like this weapon just isn't good. Hmm. So let us go and use it out on a boss, I guess, and see how it does. But I have a feeling I already know how that's going to go. What's going to be a good boss to use on this? Probably a bigger boss. I hate going to Tyrene because she has, like, invincibility stages. But she's quick and easy, and then we can get up right next to her. Nope, that's not. Unlike Grave Ward, who we have to sit back a little bit. So yeah, as you guys can see, it's not really doing the best. I just think this weapon isn't very good. So yeah, I think that was a pretty good review on the Polybius. If you guys enjoyed, make sure to leave a like, a comment, share, and a subscribe. Because of love on my channel. And I will appreciate it like always. And then let me know, did I use this weapon correctly? Did I use it wrong? If I did use it wrong, make sure to tell me. And then give me like a build or something. And then I will come back. And then we can recheck this weapon out. And I will make another video on it. However, for now, I will have to say, I hope to see you guys next time.